What is going on, X Assassin Gang? It's your boy, the one and only X Assassin. And today, we're going to hit you with a uh, Marvel's Avengers beta reaction video. Cannot wait to check this out. This video came out on July 29th, 2020. Uh, I am very excited to check this game out. I know uh, I pre ordered it, so I'm going to get early access to the game. I'm going to go ahead and stream it on my YouTube and Twitch. Uh, I believe it's going to be on August 7th, so next week on Friday, I'm going to go ahead and start streaming this game uh, starting at 12 p.m., so don't check out my live stream. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get into the uh, beta uh, video reaction. Cannot wait to check it out. Play, uh, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, the like button, and the notifications bell to get notified when I come out with new videos. And without further ado, let's go. All right, guys, and let's get into it. Uh, again, this is going to be the Marvel's Adventures beta gameplay overview. I'm um, excited to check it out. Like I said, we're going to go ahead and stream it. Uh, so don't forget to check out the stream coming out August 7th, uh, 12 p.m. Uh, so do not forget to check that out. Again, let's go. He already got Hulk, Iron Man, Thor. Ooh. Let's go. Dude, all the different customizations and stuff like that that are in, in, in introduced to the game is crazy. Crazy customizations. That's what I'm most excited about, to be able to customize my character the way I want him. The beta opens with the entire mm. Golden Gate Bridge demo, dropping players into the middle of the chain of events that led to the alien oh. disaster. This is 25 minutes of gameplay and a great introduction to how each hero plays and how combat and Dude, they show you work. so freaking much. We built the Golden Gate Bridge sequence to be this roller coaster ride of an experience with huge set oh. pieces, tons of combat and traversal and a Taskmaster boss battle. It's also a chance to try out many of each of the hero's special combos. She gave him that one, two, three, you know what I mean? Specific that moves. left hook, right hook. From there, the beta starts to open up just like the full game does, giving you new single player hero missions and eventually single player or co-op. Oh shit, so you're gonna be able to, to do co-op too on the beta? As Kamala and Hulk, you'll travel to the dense forests of the American Pacific Northwest on the trail of the Olympia Archive, the last known location of Jarvis. Jesus Christ, this is Hulk. another example of a hero mission showcasing He's just Hulk's people around. capabilities. Later, you'll take the Quinjet to a remote war zone in the frozen Russian tundra called Missing He's Links. Imaginary thing, dude. To uncover shield secrets hidden deep underground. We chose these missions for the beta because they feature a That's diverse cool. mix of locales. From wide open spaces for you to That's bound dope, through and explore. Dude. He just jumps around. Complexes bristling with high tech security at some, let's just say, mm -hmm. special interiors. You can expect heavy resistance, whichever beta missions you play, including a showdown oh, with shit, Abomination. Oh shit, you get to fucking fight him too? You should test everything that you've learned. Oh, so far. It was really important dude, you for us can't fight him without the Hulk being there. Of experiences that show Abomination. off the epic scale of the game. So these missions give you a look into the world of our story and our characters. Dude, she whoops, which she whoops ass. Khan stepping up against Aang she whoops to ass. reassemble Earth's mightiest heroes when the world needs them the most. Looking sharp, guys. Combine my two the favorites Golden right Gate there. Bridge sequence and these hero story missions Hulk and make Thor, for an already good sized Or not Hulk, Iron Man and Thor. But because Marvel's Avengers is all about the team, we knew that we needed to give you even There's more, more than that. Once you complete the single player story content, you'll have four different heroes to choose from to play in some great war zones and harm rooms that we've handpicked for the beta. Oh they shit. Are Iron Man, Kamala Khan, Black Widow. They gave you all four of these? And that means you don't have to pick just one. You can what? play them all. As you progress through the beta, you are given access to the Helicarrier, Jarvis, and the War Table, where you can play four-player co-op in three crap. different types of this missions. This whole thing is just the Harm beta. Rooms, war zones, and drop zones. God damn. Let's start with Harm Rooms. 
our holographic augmented reality machine rooms, or harm rooms for short, are virtual training simulators where heroes can take on waves of increasingly difficult enemies either solo, with a team of companion AI, or with up okay, to Okay, so you can also players. do online too, that's fucking dope. You begin dude. in the harm room training mission, which runs you through the paces of learning ah, to control so a hero. Excited. From there, you unlock three harm challenge rooms to test your teamwork. Damn. Bring your best hero build to see if you have what it takes mm -hmm. to complete all three. Dude, look at the cut. Harm look at the customization. Place to hone look at the customization, dude. Individually and as a team. While anyone can play the game, you'll need to focus and work together to make it into the there's most there's elite a blue, spaces. There's a blue Iron Man. There's a blue fucking Iron Man. Come complete. on. You can track your progress, and once you finish, you earn a nameplate that carries over That's to the full retail dope. version of the game, showing dope. that you not only played in the beta, you excel. Shit. I'm Once glad they you reach did that. this point in the beta and have an operational war table, you can also go online and tackle a series of war zone and drop zone Dude, there's missions. there's so much. We talked a lot about co-op and war zones in the first Marvel's Avengers war table. But to recap, war zones are missions you can play with up to four, four heroes, heroes they you gave you. AI with three other players Ooh. or a mix of both. There are five beta war zones to play and a wide That's variety dope. of aim enemies to take down, including a range of human and robotic foes. The first thing you notice is how each hero's traversal is true to the hero. Flyers like Iron Man approach I am from the so air with excited to just fly around, dude. Forward. Kamala and Black Widow may be on foot, but they both have unique grapple. traversal yeah, abilities you, to I grapple figured they would swing, be able to grapple. Throwing themselves in the air and even chaining together swings to increase speed and cover greater distances. Where's Spider-Man at? You'll Where's Spider-Man at? Come on, dude. Up display, but that's just telling you half the information. Trigger tactical awareness to see oh, that's everything sick. that's available to do in a mission. For instance, that right there is what we call a POI, point or point of interest. This POI is a bunker. Bunkers usually have small environmental she shooting puzzles a that unlock oh, the door I'm, once they're sold. And who's going to be shooting a gun when he can play as like Iron Man? Gear, resources, and also collectible comics. Oh shit, they, they did the whole comic thing too. Missions on the war table can take as short as 10 minutes and as long Maybe two as hours. two hours. What Trap zones are among the smaller, more focused versions of Warzone. He said up to they two hours. Always have a single objective. The beta drop zones are designed to let you and your team drop in for a single hit and run encounter. And in the full game, they're great. Dude, for look at that customization. That's heroes. fucking. That's Whether you crazy, play with dude. friends or with your companion AI team, you get in and you earn points. You exactly. That's all it is. Nice you get in, you get out. We built the beta to let you sample many of the different oh, types of gameplay and systems on. that you'll find in a full game. The beta includes missions built for different players oh, and power beta. levels. And as you build your hero, you will find that you can take on increasingly ambitious missions. Progression is one of the main systems in the full game, and the beta delivers a taste for earning experience and leveling up your Avengers. Look at that. It's in the beta, you'll have access to one of three range starting rating, skill rating, pages for each rating, hero. The gear, others open skill, up when the game launches. Cosmetics, As collection, you experience, all that you is just up. each, each level single you character. A skill point. You spend these to unlock skills and shape what each of your Avengers can do. In our first Marvel's Avengers Dude, War Table, we talked about no heroes away. and ultimates, and we teased the Hulkbuster. The Hulkbuster is Iron Man's ultimate. That's fucking sick, dude. They let you beta. use it. Right off the bat, you'll see it as a powerhouse of, well, power. Hulkbuster comes equipped with... Is he stronger? Is that... Is, I'm curious if it's stronger than Hulk. ...dash attacks that can literally sweep enemies off the battlefield. You can access Hulkbuster's rocket-propelled punches, rocket-propelled gauntlet cannon, including an extra powerful repulsor blast. Get the fuck out of here, man! What attack, is this? And the ability to sustain tons of damage. There are also some alternate deployment methods. I will leave that to you to discover in the beta. Dude, this is insane. You will also earn gear as you play, and as you level up, you'll have access to better gear with more powerful perks. And that is just in the beta. In the full game, you have three skill pages and extensive gear to dial in your perfect playstyle and build out your Avengers roster to play your way. Speaking of your roster, 
During your first Marvel's Avengers War Table, we mentioned that playing with your companion okay. AI was a great alternative. Watch him say some shit. Your Is he wearing a suit? Solo. But there is a very good reason why we like them so much. Mm -hmm. These are your heroes playing alongside you on your team that you've unlocked and you are leveling. So let's say you start the mission as the Hulk. The game then adds your Iron Man. Okay. Your Black Widow. Your Kamala to your party. The heroes in your party are using mm -hmm. the skills that you've unlocked. So everyone's going to be different. You've equipped. But you can then mix and match to create a tailor-made party composition that plays the way that you want to play. Dude, come on. This is a great way for a solo player to play as a team in the yeah, game. Yeah, and you don't need and any friends. Data. Team composition matters in Marvel's Avengers. That's dope, man. Building out a team with pure or hybrid melee and ranged builds allows you to do a lot more with what you have. That's crazy. This was a quick overview of the beta. It is a big experience. It's a with huge more than 20 beta. Combined co -op and single player you can probably play this beta until the game literally comes out. Takes of the customizations, outfits, and upgrades, and even some secrets you'll have to discover <laughs> by yourself. Dude, I'm fucking stoked for this. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let me know what your favorite character is. Let me know who you're ready to play as. That, that's insane, dude. Like, what? What? That whole game, that whole game is like, the beta is insane. Wow, well, I am very excited to freaking play this game. Like I said, I pre-ordered it on PlayStation. I'm going to go ahead and get early access to the beta. Everyone knows the beta for PlayStation is going to be August 7th. So please come check out my live stream. We're going to be playing this game. We're going to be progressing. We're going to be giving our opinions. I'm also planning to, uh, to come out with a video with our thoughts and opinions of the beta afterwards. Um, so yeah, let me know what character you guys are excited to play as. I am honestly dying to play as Iron Man, but I know I'm not. I don't have Thor, unfortunately. When it comes out, you know we'll we'll, we'll get into that. But damn, that looks like a really big beta. Um, whew. Let me know what you think again. Um, comment below if you're excited, if you pre-ordered it, what what platform you're gonna play it on, all that fun stuff, uh, and. Um, yeah excited to see you guys at my live stream again thank you guys i appreciate all the support we're about the 800 900 subscribers on youtube which is insane i i'm literally lost track it's it's unbelievable and i'm excited that you guys are enjoying my videos and that you guys are enjoying the content so please don't forget to hit that th that thumbs up uh subscribe button and also the notifications bell so you can get notified when i live stream when i come out with new videos when i come out with new reactions new gameplay and all my new thoughts and opinions uh again thank you thank you thank you thank you so much let's get it to a thousand uh i don't know what's it, august 2nd let's get it to a thousand by the end of september october 1st let's get it ex assassin gaming let's go Thank you.